Hello, my name is Gabriella, and today I'm going to show you my recycling project that I created for my ASU 101 class that will be demonstrated at the 2018 Recycling Fair at ASU Lake Havasu. For my project, I decided to create a wreath made out of water bottles that I shaped into flowers, as well as some leftover materials that I reused from prior projects. So first you will need a wire wreath frame. The one that I used, I took from a different project that I did. This one's a bit smaller. This one's like 12 inches, and I think that one is 16 or 18 inches. You'll need some water bottles. My family recycles water bottles, so I just took some out of our recycling bin. It's better if they're not crushed, but you can use the crushed ones and it just adds more texture to them. And then you're gonna need some leftover materials, whatever type of ribbon or burlap you wanna use to decorate it. Some paints, a foam brush, some scissors, a hot glue gun, and then, of course, whatever different paints you want to use. I used five different colors, but depending on the season, you can use whatever colors you'd like. So to start off, you're going to cut the water bottle at the bottom and cut it all the way around. And then I took the tops of the water bottles that I didn't use and threw them back in the recycling bin. And then you're just going to cut on the folds of the water bottle on the bottom. And depending on the water bottle you have, the different folds will be able to show. And then you just pop them out almost like a star. And then round them off on the ends to make them like flower petals. And then you can throw those scraps in the plastic recycling bin as well. And then next I use some recycling newspaper to put some paint on, whatever color you decide. And then you're going to take your foam brush and then you can just paint over the top of it, however many coats it takes. And then I'm not going to do the full one because it takes a while for them to dry and it'll end up looking like this. You have a matte side or a shiny side. For my project, I decided to use the shiny side of the flower. So once you have all the different colors done, whatever you want to do, and some of them can look different, then you're going to glue them on. So you're going to take your hot glue gun and you're going to decide which side you want to use. And then you're going to flip it over to the back and then just add hot glue. To wherever you want it to stick. And then you'll just hold it till it dries. And then it'll stick on there like this. And then you'll have the next one and you can just glue them however you want to hide the wire in whatever pattern you'd like. And then it'll probably take the wreath frame that I did took about 60 water bottles. So it just depends and it depends on how full you want it and so on and so forth. And then on the end, you'll have this side won't look very pretty. So you'll want to take some sort of material and line the back of it. I use leftover burlap ribbon that I had from a different project. I have a scrap bin and I just took some of that. And then you can decorate the front once you're done, however you'd like. You can paint the leftover water bottle caps and put them on the flowers if you'd like. You can use ribbon, whatever different types of things you'd like. And that leaves you with this finished product.